Hello everybody, welcome back to a brand new episode of Bunny Bay. Oh my goodness, I have a lot of arrows in my body. Help me. Help, send help. Uh, but I hope all of you guys are having a wonderful day today. And I have finally picked a name for our lovely turtle here. So I will be naming him in just a second. Um, I asked, I had a little conversation with Tomo and Panda. And we went over some turtle names. And... <laughs> I am going to go with a very, very special Disney name for a turtle, but let's go ahead and make an anvil really quick so we can go ahead and name our turtle. And since I did buy so many name tags from Tomo, I have tons that I can use to go ahead and name this turtle. So let's go ahead and just put it right here for now. There we go. And my name tags. See, so we are going to go ahead and name our first turtle ever crush like this crush <laughs> crush the turtles so let's go ahead and get that and crush there you go so i will be building crush a very special home of his own in the future but for now we're just trying to get things settled i'll also be building an awesome home for echo and any other animals that we get which i will get all the animals uh, just you wait and see uh, but for today our mission is to try and use our heart of the sea to make a conduit block. So in order to do that, we're going to need to do a couple of things. Uh, so I'm pretty excited. I need new armor. So we're going to make a set of diamond armor. And hopefully that will help us on our adventures today. Since we will be uh, fighting some pretty dangerous, creepy uh, underwater creatures. And let's see. Yeah, I just have my iron chest plate that's about to break and everything else is broken so let's go ahead and put that on and i do want to go ahead and enchant some things today i have 30 levels so maybe i can go ahead and get some more um <laughs> if i char really hard i also want to go ahead and make some more potions uh today i want to make some uh i have a bunch of underwater breathing and i want to make some night vision potions so let's go ahead and get a few of gold so we can go ahead and make some more golden carrots. Let's see, how many golden carrots does this make? This makes seven. Okay, so let's go ahead and just turn the rest of this gold into golden carrots since I have been using golden carrots as a food source too. So everything that I've been eating usually is just golden carrots. So I think that's fitting for bunny bay because bunnies like carrots and, you know, it just, it just fits. And it has the same saturation as steak, so that is pretty awesome. And uh, let's go ahead and put this gold back for the future. And Heart of the Sea, I want to use you. So we're going to need to get some shells uh, for the Heart of the Sea. And we need Nautilus shells, which we get from either zombies or we get from fishing. And then we also need some prismarine blocks that are from underwater temples, which is what we're gonna do today. We're gonna see if we can find an underwater temple and defeat it and get some really awesome stuff and mine up some of that very precious uh, prismarine and, and uh, sea lanterns and all kinds of jazz like that. So let's go ahead and make some potions. Uh, we do have a brewing stand and spawn. All right, so let's go ahead and do that. Goodbye, Echo. Goodbye, Crush. I will be back later, hopefully with some very precious treasures. Uh, we might also do some fishing today to see if we can go ahead and get some of the Nautilus shells. So we can go ahead and use that to make our conduit block. Oh my goodness, guys, this is so exciting. This is one of the best Minecraft updates ever. Oh my goodness. All right, so let's go ahead and do some enchanting. Oh, did I bring lapis? I'm gonna need some lapis. Hold on. BRB. <laughs> and now we have our lapis and we're going to go ahead and do some enchanting and go ahead and make some extra potions. So uh, I have another war. I need some more bottles. Let's go ahead and do this. Uh, there we go. And we need to fill them up. Let's go ahead and use our farm water because what better water than farm water to go ahead and make some of our potions. So here we go. And then I want to make them night vision, so I think it's a golden carrot, and then we'll use a piece of redstone dust to go ahead and boost that up. So there we go, making some of those, and then let's go ahead and do some enchant. So let's see, I want to get a good sword. We can get sharpness three, sharpness two. Hmm. <laughs> um. Yes. 
All right, so we have sharp, sharpness three and fire aspect two. And then I want to enchant some of my armor, but we're gonna go ahead and just take the enchanting table and move it away from the bookshelves because we're going to need some low, low level enchants since we only have 27 levels left. So let's go ahead and pull off our armor to see what we can get. And uh, protection one, unbreaking, uh, feather falling, protection one. What about this? Unbreaking protection. All right, so let's go ahead and just get protection one on this. And let's go ahead and get protection one. And protection one, perfect. And protection one, awesome. All right, so we have a little bit extra protection on our armor. Not perfect, but uh, you know, we have to work with the levels that we have. So I am quite okay with that. And let's go ahead and put the enchanting table back so that our friends can use it. And let's go ahead and check on our potions, hopefully. Uh, these are ready, yep. So now we just go ahead and put in our golden carrot and then eventually our redstone. And we have three bottles of night vision eight or night vision for eight minutes. So that should be helpful for us. Uh, we have a boat, uh, we have a fishing rod, which you might do some fishing later. All right, so I'm excited. So I think I know where an underwater temple is. So we're going to go ahead and see if we can find it today. And it was this way. So let's go ahead and go in the ocean, swim around, and see if we can find an underwater temple. Dun, dun, dun. And I think, I think I have found one. I see those creatures and I see the temples. So I believe, yes, this is indeed. Oh my gosh. Okay, yes. <laughs> that is an underwater temple. That thing scares me every single time. What's over there? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. They're touching me. They're touching me. We're going to have to fight. We're going to have to battle. We need the stuff in there. We need some prismarine. And having some sponge would actually make building uh, underwater pretty helpful. So we're going to go ahead and see... Can we get you? Oh my goodness, you guys are so strong. What the heck? Oh, there's ink sacs everywhere. What the heck? Do you guys- Oh yeah, they kill the squid, don't they? Uh, these- these creatures like to kill the squid. Oh gosh. We need to be more powerful. It's hard. Alright, let's go ahead and get you. Uh, oh my goodness. They swim. They swim so fast. Alright. Can we get you? Can we get you? Oh my goodness. Maybe we should put some of these like uh, sea creatures in some like aquariums too. That might be kind of fun. Uh, but we'll have to see. Oh my goodness. These little fishies, man. They're so strong. There we go. We got you. We got you. We got ourselves a prismarine shard. So let's go ahead and take an underwater breathing potion and also a night vision potion. And this should help us, yes, to see underwater. So we want to go ahead and get inside this temple. We need to go ahead and kill the guardians that are within. So let's go ahead and see, oh gosh, if we can find them. Why am I, oh gosh. Why is the entrance blocked up? Oh wait, there's entrance over here. Okay, let's eat some food. All right, so we are on a mission to find the guardians. Oh gosh, get this guy out of here since he's in our way. No, 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 no. I will get you. There we go. We got you. Oh, you dropped some fish. Interesting. And we'll get this guy too. Get out of my way. Oh gosh. They're so strong. And look at all the sea like lanterns in here. I definitely, I want all these sea lanterns and these prismarines. Uh, I need them. I need them for a conduit block and I need them because they're just so pretty. Like I just, I just want them. I need them. All right. Um, is it blocked off this way? All right. So this room is useless <laughs> other than the fact that it has some sea lanterns and let's go ahead and get you oh gosh oh we can go up okay let's go ahead and go up thanks for showing me the way guys um oh gosh this is so scary this is so scary get get out of here and let's see it goes up quite a bit um is there anything over this way we need to find the guardians. So where, where would the guardians reside? If I were a guardian, I would eat some golden carrots. Let's go ahead and do that. And then, oh gosh, there's a crazy man over there. And who is in here? Nothing in here, just a big empty room. Okay. And what about this way? We have some more of these guys, more fishy fishies. 
All right, we'll get you. Oh gosh. You got your big eye. You're like a cyclops. You're crazy. You're like a mythical beast. And we got you, more fishies. And I guess we'll go up to see if we can find uh, the guardian of this. Oh gosh, I found him. I found the guardian of this temple. I found one of them at least. Oh my goodness, you are huge. And you are strong. Uh, but we're gonna get you. Don't, don't you worry. We are going to take over your temple. Even if it's the last thing I do. So we'll get you. Ah, oh, we did it! Awesome! And he dropped some sponge too. Which is amazing. So thank you so much for doing that. And yes, we got some wet sponge. And if we go ahead and put that wet sponge in a furnace, we can go ahead and make it into dry sponge, which will suck up the water. Uh, there's not like a sponge room up here, is there? Uh, let's see, mining fatigue, we still have that on there. So I wonder if there's more guardians in this temple. I guess we'll see um, if our mining fatigue wears off, then there's no more guardians. But if it doesn't, that means there's some more guardians lurking somewhere. And I wonder if there's a sponge room in here too. Oh, there's still guardians in here. All right, so we have to go ahead and see if we can find all of the guardians within this temple. Uh, what about this way? We'll get you, little fishy. Don't run away from me. I will get you. And you and your little friend, too. Oh, gosh. Why? Why? There we go. We got you. And then we'll go ahead and get this one, too, just because, you know, he hit us. He hit us with his beams of beaminess and things and stuff. And there we go. And prismarine shard. All right, so we'll go this way to see where the other guardian is. Let's see, is there, what's over here? What is this, just a room? Um, we'll go ahead and swim around, look around. Ooh, what's this? Ooh, 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 I found it. I found, I found another guardian. I did it, he's in a big, oh gosh, we need to eat. We're under attack, we need to eat. We need to use these pillars for our advantage. And we must fight the scary man of scariness. Oh gosh, get out of my way. Okay. You have big fins. You have huge. Oh, 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 oh. This isn't going well for us. Get out of my way. We need to swim. Oh gosh. Okay, we got him. We got him. We got him. We got him. But they're gonna get us. All right. Oh, I'm stuck. 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 Okay. So we got two guardians down. So there is just maybe one more. We'll have to see. Um, we do have keep inventory on. Thank goodness. Uh, we got some cook cod, rock cod, prismarine crystals and shards. Uh, let's go ahead and make another bow and go back to that temple to see what else there is lurking. Can I just? Put a boat like this. Ooh. Ooh, I'm sinking. This is weird. <laughs> uh-huh. 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 Okay. It stopped. Give me my boat back. Mine. Oh, no, 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 no. So I wonder if there is another guardian. Sometimes there's only two guardians in there, so I don't know for sure. Uh, let's go ahead and take a water breathing potion and also a night vision potion to help us out a little bit. There we go. We can see a lot better. And let's go ahead and go down and see. Oh, there he is. I see the guardian. The guardian's just right outside his temple. Interesting. All right. Well, we'll go ahead and get you out of the way. This is my temple. I need it. I need all your goodness inside, which is weird. I don't know why you're like outside of your temple. That's so weird. Um, <laughs> okay. Oh gosh, I'm stuck. Why? 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 Yeah, it looks like the temple like grew. Like there's pillars down here. Maybe it like broke when it was growing. Oh gosh. Okay, we need. We need to. To be smart. We need to go ahead and heal up first. Okay. Let's go ahead and swim up. We don't want to 
die again if we don't have to. And let's go ahead and get some more health. Uh, we know where the guardian is at least. The guardian is underneath the temple and its brokenness. Uh, let's go ahead and eat some golden carrot and regen our health. Alright, so now we know where he is. He is right down here. We will get you. Oh, we got him! We got him! We did it! We get it! Oh gosh, I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck. Okay, so we got, we got him. And I think our mining fatigue should wear off, unless there is another guardian in here. Um, but let's go ahead and see um, if we, let's see, is F3? Three, uh, we just look at um, E. So mining fatigue for 3 minutes and 48 seconds. So let's go ahead and see if that wears off. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Is it gone? Oh gosh, there's there's another one in there. There's another guardian. Wait, there's more than 3 guardians in here? What the heck? Okay, so it looks like we have some more things to do. Uh, we need to find another guardian. Oh my goodness. Oh, and there is a dude. In a boat. Dude in a boat, everybody. Dude in a boat. Alright, so it looks like we have more guardians to find, which I'm surprised that there's more than three. Uh, but I guess we'll do this thing. We'll do it. We'll go ahead and take another night vision, another underwater breathing potion, and we're gonna go ahead and find this guardian. Is it like two temples in one? What the heck? This is crazy. Oh gosh. They're crazy. So we're underneath. Is this two temples? This might be two temples. Oh my goodness. How crazy would that be? All right, so let's go ahead and see if there's another entrance this way to see. Oh gosh, there's a drown down there. Drown is coming for me. Oh no. Well, hopefully that means if there's more that we can find like a sponge room. I think that'd be really cool uh, if we could find one of those so we can get a bunch more sponges. Uh, is there an entrance over this way? I don't think so. Oh, there's a bunch of fishies over here. Is that the only way to get through? I guess that might be the only way to get through. Let's see, underneath, is there any way to get in? I don't think so. All right, so I guess we gotta go in the way that we came <laughs> before um, and see if we can find the other guardians because apparently there's more than three in this one, which is pretty insane. So we got ourselves, oh gosh, a big temple with lots and lots of baddies inside. So let's go ahead and go in here and see what we could find if we're going inside. All right, and then we go this way and come over here and get out of this way. Get through this. So I think this definitely is like a broken, <laughs> a broken uh, underwater temple. I think it's like two temples in one. So I did find another guardian that's hiding in here. Ooh, what's that? There's some orange stuff coming through the walls, but here's this guy. So let's go ahead and see, oh gosh, if we can get him. And I'm not sure if there's any more like of these guys lurking. So we'll have to go ahead and explore some more, but this is fun. Uh, hopefully he has some more goodies for us. Um, oh gosh, we're gonna, we're gonna get dead. <laughs> Let's go ahead and see if we can heal up and eat some delicious carrots and oh gosh, oh gosh, there's, there's the thing. Uh, let's go back this way, heal up, and see if we get this guardian dude. This is my sea temple now. This belongs to me. Okay, we got him. Awesome. And we got more sponge. And I guess we'll go ahead and explore and see if there's any more guardians this way uh, through this side of this weird broken temple. Um, are there any more of your leaders in here? Or is it just a bunch of you guys? Just a bunch of fishies in the sea. And, ooh, what's this? Very, oh gosh, oh, oh, oh. Don't hurt me because I'm beautiful. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. And would you look at that? No mining fatigue. So I think we were victorious in killing all the guardians that are in this weird temple. So now that means we get to go ahead and gather up all this loot. And I forget, do we need to go ahead and use silk touch for these sea lanterns? Um, the answer is yes. Yes, we do. Right? Did it break? What happened? I didn't see. 
Yes, okay, it broke into crystals. Okay, you, you definitely need to go ahead and use our silk touch on these lanterns if we want them. And so what I'm gonna do is gather up a bunch of this stuff because I want to use it to go ahead and make our conduit block eventually and just to have like some pretty uh, prismarine stuff to go ahead and decorate our base with. I think that'll be so awesome. And there's like a bunch of different types we can get. There's the dark green um, one. See, there's dark prismarine, prismarine brick, and just the straight up prismarine right here. So I'm going to be busy gathering up all this stuff. Oh my gosh. This is going to be so awesome. And this makes us one step closer to going and getting our conduit block. Yes. <laughs> so I am back from uh, gathering things and I seem to have gotten myself a little friend to go ahead and bring home. So, oh my goodness, what do I do with this guy? Is he gonna like drown? Do I, is he in the water? I can't even tell. So, um, um, uh, what do, what do we do? What do we do with the thing? Guardian dude, what do we do with you? Uh, it's quite interesting though. It doesn't seem to be able to hurt me in this boat, which I think is quite funny. <laughs> Uh, but we have ourselves a little friend to go ahead and remember the day that we uh, did our very first sea temple. Oh gosh, he's like killing the squid in the boat. What the heck? He just murdered a squid. You're a murderer. You are a squid murderer. So we name you Ink because you really seem to like Ink. Oh wait, can I put the boat up here? Let's see if I get out. Um, no, okay, I can't push the boat unless I had... If I had a half slab, let's see. We're gonna we're gonna do some experimenting today to see. Uh, or actually, you know what? Maybe we'll just build. Hmm. Maybe I'll just build you like a little enclosure right now, kind of like in the water area over here. Oh gosh, I hurt you. I'm so sorry. You're my friend, and I hurt you. Why do I hurt everything that I love? But maybe we'll keep you over here for now, uh, and then eventually we'll make you a nice little home somewhere. Hmm, I think we'll do that. So let's go ahead. I don't really want to leave you in the boat, and I think I should name you. I should, shouldn't I? Alright, let me bring you closer, because I'm afraid that you'll despawn if I just leave you. Uh, so let's go ahead and go over here to where I have my name tags. Uh, down in this location. We'll leave you in there. Let's go ahead and quickly uh, name... With our name tags, hopefully we're close enough where he won't despawn. And if he does despawn, I'll be really sad. But let's go ahead and name him Ink. We're going to name him Ink because he likes to kill squids with Ink. So he must really love Ink. So we're going to name him Ink. Um, <laughs> ink! Ink! You have a name, Ink! I'm so excited. All right, so hopefully you won't despawn now. All right, uh, we do have... Yeah, we can build... A little enclosure just a temporary enclosure we'll build you uh, a nice home in the future ink don't you worry but we'll go ahead and put you uh, over here for now yes or maybe I'll keep you in the boat because you don't seem to be drowning or anything decisions decisions should I keep you in the boat I think I'm gonna try to keep you in the boat because I know with the boat I can go ahead and transport you around uh, but yeah, so we'll keep you in the boat for now, and then we'll make you a home in the future. Uh, oh gosh, it hurts. It hurts. And hopefully no one will kill you. What if someone comes to visit? Maybe I'll put you... I'm so concerned about Ink. I don't want Ink to die. Ink is my friend, okay guys? I know he hurts me sometimes, but we're friends. We're cool. I'll leave you over here for now. And hopefully you won't hurt anybody that tries to come visit my base. Uh, and I can keep you forever and ever, Ink. We can be the best of friends. Um, <laughs> but I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Bunny Bay. Let me know what you guys think about it down in the comment section below. We found ourselves a broken temple and we got ourselves a new friend named Ink who likes to hurt me, but it's cool. Everything will be fine. Um, but I will see you guys in the next episode as we continue our adventures. Bye!